Hello Liza here, so uh, Minecraft Pocket Edition update was out, it is the 1.2.5 update, if you do want to download and update it, as I said the update is out, and the big thing in this update is you can now broadcast, so you can actually, if you have the application called Mixer, which I actually might do, so comment below if you want to see some Minecraft Pocket Edition being broadcast by me. I've never gone live before, so I reckon it'd be pretty cool, but in this video we're not going to be really talking about that too much or doing so, we're actually going to be talking about the render distance, so as you can see the render distance still says max, you can get 6 chunks, uh, but that actually unlocked the features so you can actually change the options text to actually get a further render distance. Uh, this was a trick back in the day. You could either use iFile but since I'm not jailbroken I really do miss jailbroken. I want to do it one day again but I can't but anyway uh, but yeah but I'm using iExplorer as you can see there got iExplorer there that's what I'll be using for this tutorial. If you are enjoying the video make sure you leave a like comment and subscribe it really does help me out but anyway as you can see the render distance six chunks there and that is the render distance way for it. Oh not too bad not too shabby. So you want to close off Minecraft and just, I guess, like just turn your device off, I guess. But anyway, let's move on to iExplorer. So in iExplorer, as you can see right there, that's what I'm using. Uh, you want to go into apps and you want to wait for it to load. And then you want to find Minecraft. So as you can see here, Minecraft, double click on that. Then you want to go to games, dot mojang. And then you want to go into Minecraft PE. And then you will see in here a bunch of different files. But we want the options text, as you can see right there. We want that bad boy. Uh, so this, you just want to drag it into your desktop so you can actually edit it. Double click on it, it will open up in here. So you've got all these different types of things in here and you want to find the render distance one. Okay, so I found the view distance. It's on 96, so I want to change that to a higher number. So I'll just do 150. Uh, so once you have changed that, you just want to close it off and you want to save it, I guess, so just save it to that. And then with the um, modified file, you just want to drag and drop it into the, well, into iExplorer. And then it will say, do you want to replace? You'll just, yeah, yes, yeah, so you want to replace it so you can use this as the um, file. Uh, so once you have done that, you just want to close off iExplorer and then launch up Minecraft Pocket Edition. And you should see a change in the render distance. Uh, so as you will see in my video settings, it has changed the render distance to 9 chunks by putting in 150 apparently. Uh, so we close that off, you can actually see there is a significant difference in the render distance. So that is how you change the render distance in Minecraft Pocket Edition by using a PC. If you are jailbroken, you can just use iFile, it's probably a lot easier to do that, but a lot of people are not jailbroken these days. Uh, so yeah, if you did enjoy the video and it really did help you out, make sure to leave a like, it really helps me out if you subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss a Minecraft video. Uh, so thank you for watching this tutorial and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.